Question seven is about simultaneous equations and percentage error. So we're given some information about the passengers of uh, an airline who can purchase either business or economy class tickets. We know that um, on one particular flight, there are 154 passengers, and we're given two variables. So we're told that um, X is the number of business class passengers, and Y is the number of economy class passengers. And we're asked to use this information to write an equation in X um, and Y. So we know that if X is the number of business class passengers and Y is the number of economy class passengers, that must be the total number of passengers, which is 154. So the first equation, quite simply, is going to be X plus Y equals 154. We're then told um, that the cost of a business class uh, ticket is 320 euros and the cost for an economy class ticket is 85 euros and we know that the total amount that the airway re airway received was 14970 euros so um in order to construct a second equation we need to figure out um how to express that algebraically so if each ticket for the business class passengers was 320 euros and x is the number of the number of business class passengers we just need to multiply those two together to tell us how much revenue we got from business class passengers so that's going to be 320 x so obviously if i sold two tickets then i get 640 euros etc so that's how we can work out how much revenue we got from the business class passengers similarly for the economy class passengers if the ticket is 85 euros and we sold um y tickets then the revenue from that's going to be 85 y so we don't know what x and y are at the moment but we know that in total the airline received 14,970 euros so in effect now um, we've got our first equation up here and our second equation up here and the simplest way of solving these is just using the simultaneous equation solver on your GDC. And if you do that, you end up with a value of x as 8 and uh, y is 146. So those are the um, number of tickets sold for uh, business and economy passengers and you can double check that together they do add up to 154. Uh, part D then was quite uh, su more surprisingly problematic. All you need to do here is find the percentage error and indeed uh, a number of you just lifted the um, formula from the formula booklet which is uh, VA or the approximate value minus VE which is the exact value divided by VE so that's this, these uh, symbols uh, here mean the modulus. So we just take the positive value and we multiply that by uh, 100. So in the context of the question then, we know that VA is the approximate answer because we're told that the airline's finance officer wrote down the amount received by these um, uh, tickets as 14,270. So that's the approximate value. So we then need to subtract the exact value, which we've um, worked, uh, or what we've got uh, here, which is 14,970. Divide that by uh, 14,970. Take the positive value of whatever that is and multiply it by 100. And if you do that, you end up with a value of 4.68% to correct to three significant figures.